Hello everybody, my name is Vito, developer at United Codes. I would like to introduce you to our newest plugin called Flowforms. Flowforms is a replacement for Apex item. We can use Flowforms to create dynamic items for our Apex applications. We can use this to generate a matrix or maybe a custom form. Instead of going our custom HTML, CSS and JavaScript route, we search for a library that handles this for us. FormKit is a framework based on Vue.js. It is an open source framework and it's fully supported by a company. Our solution consists out of a form builder, an Apex plugin, and of course this sample app. When we go to the Flowforms playground, we can see a few examples. Based on a certain schema, we can render out a form or a form input. We can also render out HTML or even more complex forms. As you can see here, there's an if property that decides when a certain input should be shown. And of course, we also have a more difficult example, a register form with full validation on all the inputs. If you fill out everything correctly, you should be able to submit your form at the end of it. Let's go over to our form builder. In here, you can see an example of all the available inputs that Flowforms has to offer. As you can see, there are three parts to this form builder. We have the form structure, which defines the layout of the form. We have the Flowforms node properties, which you can use to individually change form properties, for instance, the label, or the node name or the node type. And of course, at the right, we have the rendering of the form, but also the help text. Please join me in the next episode where I'm gonna explain how to create a simple form.